Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of VizRT Tuesday Tutorials. I am your host Richard Evans. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Now today I'd like to show you how you can trigger macros with the TriCaster Flex Duals numpad. Now this 10 key system allows you to create macros and then assign them uh, a number that you can click, 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 type onto the numpad to activate the macro, giving you a unique way to control your show and giving you tons of flexibility. So let me show you how it's done, son. All right, so I have my TriCaster 2 Elite interface up and running, and I have the TriCaster Flex Dual here on my desk, and we're gonna combine these and start showing you how to use the numpads on the uh, TriCaster Flex Dual to trigger macros. So first things first, let's go into my TriCaster 2 Elite interface, and I have some macros that I have built for today's example. So I probably, if you watch other videos, you've probably seen these before, but uh, they're really simple. So this first one, the show intro, if I click on that, keep your eye on the program window here. All it does is it zooms in to my virtual set talent and then brings up a lower third and then takes a lower third off. And that is it. Boom. All right. And then the other one that I have here just resets my camera position. So I'll hit play on that and it'll just have the camera zoom out like that. Cool. See, nothing fancy. All right, I don't want to spend a whole lot of time on the macro side of things, as I really want to show you how to focus in on the TriCaster Flex Duels way of doing this. So uh, to do that, let's go ahead and let me zoom into my Flex Duel here. And so you see on the Flex Duel, I have a few ways to do this. Uh, I can either have you uh, use uh, this numpad up here at the top uh, or we can use the numpad here at the bottom uh, but for today's example I'm going to show you both and why they are different because they are independent of each other so if you type a macro uh, command on this one uh, it does not correspond to the one that's up here so that way you can have double the macro um, actions depending on how you want to use this so first things first uh, we need to make sure that we have our num pads set to macro mode because you'll see right now it's currently highlighted as home on both of these so we'll just click on macro up here at the top all right and then now let's go back into our interface and now we're going to assign these to those buttons so from in here if I hit uh, click uh, set to trigger like that so now it's listening for a command so on the bottom one here uh, I'm just going to type in one two three and you can do whatever combinations you want. You can do just one, button one, uh, or a couple different uh, numbers, it's up to you. I'm just doing one, two, three to keep this simple for today. Okay, so one of the things I want to draw your attention to on the interface, you'll see uh, that my trigger says uh, flex multipad one, button one, two, three. Okay, so that means that we're gonna be using button the multipad one over here at the bottom and not the one at the top. Okay, now if you want to put them on both places, you would basically just say, all right, let's listen to the top one, and I can do the same thing, one, two, three, enter, and now I have both, so no matter which one I press it on, uh, it'll work, okay? But I'm going to clear that out, because I want to show you that being different, uh, and then I'll go to reset, and do the same thing, and now I'm going to use a top one, and I'm going to do uh, one, two, four, okay? Cool. All right, so now we got those uh, all up and running, and now all I have to do to start to trigger those macros is simply just go one, two, three, enter. That fast. And it will trigger my macro going on there. And then on this one, one, two, four, enter. Bam, and then it will bring my shot back out to uh, my, my wide shot. So some really cool things you can do with this. I'm only showing you two macros, but let's say you have hundreds, thousands of macros or whatever. The numpad is a really great way to do it. It frees up all the other buttons on your control panel to do whatever they're doing. Uh, and then you could just simply, you know, bang, just type them in just really quickly and get your show up and running. So really fun to play around with. I've been having a blast with this control panel as you have seen, uh, but I highly recommend checking this out. And of course, you know me, have some fun. Woo! There you go, another awesome way to use the TriCaster Flex Dual in your productions. Now you can find more tutorial videos like this one by subscribing to the VizRT YouTube channel at youtube.com slash VizRT official. You can also find uh, more information about VizRT products and services by contacting your local VizRT partner, or you can visit our website, vizrt.com. And you can also get professional training with VizRT products by signing up for Viz University at vizrt.com slash community slash viz-university. 
And if you're posting your work using VizRT products on social media, hey, tag us using the hashtags VizRT, TriCaster, or 3Play. We love seeing what you're working on. Now, that's it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon for another episode of VizRT Tuesday Tutorials.